when I was about 20 weeks pregnant um, by ultrasound, they discovered that there was something not quite right with the heart. They couldn't exactly tell what it was, but um, they sent us to St. Louis um, for some additional testing, and it was a pretty serious heart defect called AV canal. And it's typical for infants with Down syndrome to have this particular heart defect. So we were kind of on to something at that point. And we ended up doing an amniocentesis in the office there with um, Dr. Grant. Um, Dr. Elizabeth Wilson referred us over there. Um, and the amniocentesis came back positive for Down syndrome. And so by that time we had enough information to know what needed to be done, which was open heart surgery. Um, and like I said, at this point, I was only about 20 weeks pregnant, so it gave us a long time to prepare and to learn a little bit. Dr. Tim O'Connor was the neonatologist at the time, and I met with him after meeting with the people at um, Children's Hospital in St. Louis that were ultimately going to do the surgery, which I was very nervous about delivering in Columbia in case she needed to be transferred to St. Louis. But Tim O'Connor was really awesome, reassuring us that Boone would be able to take care of it. Um, everything that she needed at the time. They were familiar enough with the defect that they knew that surgery wasn't going to be imminent and that we could deliver there where our community was, where our family was, and it really made a huge difference. So by the time Olive came, we could just concentrate on having a baby instead of all of the things that were not right with the pregnancy. So after Olive was born, we got to take her home in the normal amount of time and then we had to watch for symptoms of heart failure so we could know when to start some certain medications that would keep her going until it was until she was large enough to have surgery. So we were able to see Dr. Singh here in Columbia. Um, he travels here once a month to see heart patients, um, which eased the stress of everything that we were going through and being like a woman who just had a baby, it's kind of hard to travel. So um, once she got to be 12 pounds, which was about six months of age, they went ahead and did the surgery. It just takes me hard, and then I just boom. And then, <laughs> and then I was tall. It's <laughs> kind of true. My mom. Because before they fixed your heart, you were really quiet all the time, and since they fixed your heart, you don't ever stop talking or moving. Well, Olive is in first grade at Grant Elementary, our local school, where she receives about an hour and a half or so of special education, speech therapy, that kind of thing. And she runs and jumps and plays with all the other kids and has tons of friends in the neighborhood and is super active and doesn't really stop moving until she falls asleep.